Welcome today to your buyer questionnaire sales funnel. I'm Mark Lemons Rao, real estate keynote speaker and international best-selling author. And I'm elated today to walk you through a template that was designed with buyers, agents in mind. When you open up your PDF, you're gonna have three links. One will be to the Canva template, one will be to a PDF fillable file, and another one will be to a Google form. We will start at the very top with the Canva template. You will come in and you will actually click on the link. Your browser will open. You can use this with the free version of Canva. If you do not have a Canva account, you will have to set one up. At the bottom of the screen, you see a purple button. It says use template. You will click on that and it will open into your Canva account. The beautiful thing is that everything in here you may edit. You may change your fonts. You can come in and you can change your logo, your name, your email address, and the branding of your company. And then you can come and you can download this. When you download it, I recommend that you download it as a PDF standard file, okay? But if you want to leverage this for marketing, then you can also download it either as a JPEG or as a PNG file, all right? So there's numerous options for downloading and editing this form. The second form that you have received is a PDF fillable. When you click on the link, you're going to actually open this file in my Dropbox account. Therefore, you need to download it to your computer, to your own Dropbox account. The way that you do that is you come over to the right hand side to more. You hit the download button. And now this has downloaded to your computer as a PDF fillable file. Now, if you don't use Dropbox or Office 365 on your computer, then what you can do with this is open up Google. If you use Google, go and open up your drive and then click the new button and you can load the file that I just downloaded up to your Google Drive. So there's numerous ways in which to use that. Now, the most complex of the forms is going to be the Google form. The Google form is actually a landing page, but there are some steps that you need to take to make it your own, to customize it. So we're going to come down to the Google forms and click on that link. What you see is make a copy. You're going to hit the make a copy button because you're going to copy this into your Google Drive. So we hit make a copy. And now the buyer intake form is inside of your Google Drive. And you have the ability to share this. It's four pages. You can customize it and everything. But there are a couple of steps that I want you to take to make this a full-fledged operating sales funnel. The first step is where it says responses. You would click on the response button and you're going to hit this green plus sign in order to attach a spreadsheet. That means that anytime anyone completes the form, the answers will be in the response tab and you will also have an Excel spreadsheet to capture your responses. Also, you want to add a form notification. Some of you don't already have a form notification. Therefore, you must come over to the three dots, hit the drop down arrow, come to add ons, and you want to add form notifications. Over 10 million people have downloaded this. What this is going to do is allow you to send an autoresponder. What is the autoresponder going to be? The autoresponder can either be the template or it can be the PDF fillable. I would state that you would take them either back to your page to complete it, or you will give them one of the forms 
or maybe you have a CMA or a community. Once you have clicked the form notification, there are going to be numerous steps you must walk through to approve it in your Google account. So yes, you want to accept everything so that when you then come back up to the actual puzzle piece, some of you might not even have a puzzle piece, but once you add the form notification, you would come back up here to add-ons and you would see form notifications. Now, usually there's a little button before this help button that I am not seeing. So what I want to do is now just simply refresh my browser, come back over to the add-on puzzle piece, hit form notifications, and you see the word open. This is what you want to see. So if you don't see it, simply refresh. When we open the forms notification tab, the first thing is I want to hit notify on form responses. You can put your email, even a teammate mate's email address here. Where it says send notification after 10 responses, you do not want it to say 10. You want it to say one. You must change that number to one so that every time someone fills out the form, it will send a notification. You want to turn on the thank you email, and I do not want to select automatically. I want to select by field, and I want to select the email field. The reason for this is that every time someone submits their email address, they will receive an autoresponder form. Now, because this system is 100% free, what you will have to do where it says notification email body, both of these are customized, whether it's the notification email subject and the notification email body. But what you have to do is go get a link to the actual document. What do I mean by that? Well, if you are using Dropbox, if you are using Office 365, if you are using Google, every form in those systems has its own URL. They're essentially standalone web pages. So an example would be, I'm just gonna come over here uh, to a document. Uh, this is a beautiful video recap with my girl, Christy. I'm gonna right click on this. I'm gonna hit share. At the bottom, it's gonna say create a link. I am going to copy that link, come back over to my form, paste it in my form so that now anytime anyone receives this email, they will already have that video if the video is what I said that I was going to deliver. And then you hit the save configuration. I am going to include a link to a video where it goes into great detail on how to set up Google Forms, but this is essentially your system that you get to customize with the Canva template, a PDF fillable, and a Google form. Let's take action every single day in order to increase our business and drive more sales to us.